Well, it's uh, Wednesday, about 2.30. Ties low, uh, three, two hours and uh, three, three hours here on the bay, two hours on the ocean. I was going for a spin today, but a few things came up. That's one of them. I went for a spin yesterday, didn't carry my camera, just to see what it looked like after that big storm we had. I found a fair amount of targets, nothing of any consequence. I ran into the guru, I'll add the pictures at the end of this video. And here's what else I got tied up on. Fish house knives. And then a lady called me with two pair of pinkers. I had to go pick them up. This car's relatively new. An old pair of Weiss. These are old. These, she said these were her mother's. They just need a little cleaning up. I think they'll be okay. They got a lot of knives today. A lot of fish knives. That's the most I think I ever got it one time. I mean, I've come close to it one time before. I haven't even counted them, so I don't know how many is here. But it'll keep me busy the rest of the day and probably tomorrow for a while. So that's what I'll be doing. My leader is uh, working in the mulch now. Her and her son picked it up today in his pickup. I've been waiting in the mail for some sharpening belts to come in. And I was hoping this was it. But I said, damn, that's an awful small belt for sharpening belts. But I can tell you, what's in this box is glory. This is the second or third year in a row I've gotten this. I think you've probably seen them before. Bad for my diet. Because Thanksgiving was bad for it. And I guess Christmas is going to be worse. And this ain't going to help any. Homemade peanut brittle. Cashew peanut brittle. Peanut peanut brittle. This right here, buddy, will take your damn breath away right here. Yes, sir. -y. Oh, me. Mmm, good googa mooga. Whew. Now get back to you. I got my fish knife soaking in some bleach. Man, they get their rough tickets. The gig master went to Sandbridge yesterday. He called me. He said, Max, I got a 14K and a silver ring and a lot of clad. Well, I ain't driving to Sandbridge. It's like 35 miles. But I did, like I said, I went out front here and dug around a while. There were some targets around. Just no consequence of anything great. Uh, they're all out today. Uh, I don't know about the Mumbles man, but Beaver's out. Uh, gigs at 13th Street. He sent me some pictures a minute ago. It's got a nice... Well, it looks like it was a fairly nice cut down that way yesterday, but it's kind of fell back a little bit today. Might even sand it in some, according to his report. But they're all down there hunting for something. So maybe we'll get a report we can add to the end of this video. I know Beaver just found a little silver cross. And the guru was headed down. So there's some activity. It's, uh, it's in the high 40s today. So it'll be pretty nice tomorrow and some rain coming in Friday or even for the market on Saturday I might get rained out and I'm not sure. It would be really kind of, you know, just bad weather. Not a gully washer by no means, but I don't know what it's going to be. I'll get back to you again. Alright, there's a gig master's loot right there. He got a trifecta. He got a silver ticket. A titanium, he thinks, and a 10K with fake ice, CZs. The Landonata. 
I think Beaver, I told you, got a cross. And that's, uh, I believe, Gigmaster went back to Sandbridge. He just, he was so poor at the land of Nada that he went back to Sandbridge and found all this at Sandbridge, which is 15 or 20 miles uh, south of the land of Nada. Pretty good day. Good going, Mr. Gigmaster. See ya. You digging a nest for yourself? You can't do that. That's my leg you're digging on. <laughs> you want a little baby scooter. Big old Jack, he's sleeping right here. And the Indian. You know where the Indian is? There's Mama over there. Hey.